Hey, it's Matt with McGee Farms, and we got a new tool slash, I guess, toy for me to uh, play with. Uh, it's a Ryobi uh, cordless lopper. It's I like my Ryobi tools as one of the uh, uh, One Plus series of tools. I picked it up the other day, and uh, we got a nice day. It's not super cold, but it's cold enough the bugs aren't out, so I need to start trimming the fruit trees. So I figured I'd uh, invite you along, and let's see how this works. All right, we're gonna start with our driveway apple trees. Go. Angle this down. I got a new mount I'm trying here, so yeah, this one's pretty woolly and needs some work. Let's see. We got it. This one. Oh, this is nice. This is nice. <sighs> and I'm not an expert at, uh, at trimming these. I know kind of the basics. I probably trim more than I should, but... We've kind of got weird ground here as well. It, uh, these trees really are pretty loose in the ground. And I'm not exactly sure why that is. But This thing is great. I wish I would have known about this years ago. So. You wanna make sure when you're trimming that uh, when you got fruit on there that they get, it gets plenty of air in. I do know that. Let's see these that are along the road. Try to trim up so they're not hitting the cars. Makes it a little easier for me to mow. And I'll come in, I'll trim out a couple times uh, this winter, but. First chance, plus I got this new toy, so. I'm getting this with the camera. couple of them on the uh, orchard part that are really really bad that are gonna take quite a bit of work Let's see take this one out plus if you know anyone uh, that does uh, a lot of smoking it is like meat smoking that uh, you know not like a nasty habit uh, this, all these that you're cutting, you know, they'll gladly take them. Okay. You always want to do this when it's kind of a little chilly out and the bugs aren't out. It keeps them from getting into the trees. Then also... See spots like right here where you got bad spots in them. I'm going to go ahead and cut that off. Get another one up here. I had another tree that had quite a few of these I noticed yesterday. Let me cut them. Let 
with ours. Like I said, the soil. All right, well, I'm going to call it a, uh, a wrap on these. I'm going to go get these uh, crazy trees right now and start working them a little bit. And uh, anyway, it's a, uh, the Ryobi Cordless Lopper. And uh, I like this. I wish I would have had one of these years ago. This is, I'm not going to say my favorite tool, but this is going to be one of my favorites as of today since getting it. So definitely check it out. I do like the Ryobi products. I switched to them a couple years ago just on a, on a whim. And uh, very happy with the OnePlus. Uh, anyone from Ryobi is actually uh, watching this. You know, if you want to send me some free tools or sponsor me, I'm always uh, always interested uh, in, in tools. It's Matt from McGee Farms. If you enjoy the video, please consider subscribing, giving us a thumbs up, commenting if you got any questions. I always try to answer them. You can always send us an email too. The email's on the page uh, if you look on the info. But it's always appreciated and it helps the channel grow. Till next time, have a great day.